This is red, left wing's all clear. This is white, the rear is secured. All right, guys, move in. Science, technology, and magic coincide in the world of the Lancis. For many years, countries have been at war with each other over world domination. The most powerful weapon from the arsenals of the various forces in this desperate war was the weapon monsters, biomechanical organisms that had been transformed into killing machines. After a series of setbacks, the leaders of the outnumbered forces of Gyamal have been secretly planning the production of weapon monsters. The scientists finally succeed in capturing the Gods of Magic, a group of sorcerers whose powers are essential to the production of weapon monsters. The production of the monsters begins. Soon, the scientists realize that they are unable to fully control the powers of the Gods of Magic. Halfway through the production process, the sorcerers begin to partially awaken from their trances and, with powerful spells, take over the main computer which controls the complex. Before they can react, the rampaging weapon monsters controlled by the gods of magic wipe out the entire group of scientists and guards. It's only a matter of time before the sorcerers completely awaken. If these uncontrollable magical fiends should completely free themselves from their trances, they might destroy the entire Earth. The leaders cannot recall the regular army from the battlefield. Instead, they dispatch an urgent communique to the special elite forces scattered throughout the world eliminate the gods of magic, and recapture the research facility as soon as possible. I don't know who's listening to this recording, but welcome to the Metal Dungeon. I'm 
really glad to have daredevils like you in this filthy den of weapon monsters. First of all, let's go through the very basics of what the Metal Dungeon is. Originally, this dungeon was constructed as an advanced weapon development facility. I said it was because it is now overrun with monsters which have been created in here. Okay, I know you're eager to hear a little more useful information about the dungeon, correct? Since this is a recording for you newcomers, you need to know that it is a rule by the Guillemel government that the first person through an area of the dungeon must record a log of events. This priceless information could save your life, so listen carefully, kid. This dungeon changes its shape every time you re-enter. It's supposed to be a facility defense mechanism, but this feature will be a real hassle. Don't be fooled by this function. You also will see a bunch of guard machines. They're really annoying, so watch out for them. In order to go through Area 1, you need to activate a control room door. There should be two terminal rooms somewhere on each floor, and you can open the control room door via interfaces. Finding one of these is your first priority in this area. You'll encounter a very powerful monster inside the control room. Don't get too relaxed yet. Well, that's about it. Lastly, I'll give you some advice. Don't die in here. It's not a shame to run away. It'll add to your experience. I hope we'll meet in person someday. Alive. That's it.